top 10 places to visit in Malta in 2023. Visit Malta to enjoy beautiful beaches and local Maltese food, and then get fit by walking around the fossil-infused limestone cliffs. Places like Valletta, Gozo Island, and Rabat Town offer some of the best tourist attractions in the world. There are many attractions in Malta that will awe you. In today's video, we take a look at the top 10 places to visit in Malta in 2023. Number 10. Valletta Visitors can check out the brilliant National War Museum, discover the history of the Lascaris War Rooms, and go for lunch at the Valletta Food Market. Here, several food outlets are serving traditional meals, like Bagilla, Imkarun Il Forn. You can also get Chinese, Italian, barbecue, American, and Mexican food. In Valletta, you can also learn history about the Malta experience, while enjoying the sun at the Lower Baraka Gardens. Valletta is full of fine churches, and visitors can check out the Basilica of Our Lady of Mount Carmel. If you want to enjoy a cocktail or grab a bite, Republic Street is the place to be. You can enjoy lunch by the Grand Master's Palace at St. George Square. Number 9. Gozo Island Relax on Ramia Bay Beach, which is a sandy beach with a clear and calm sea. Sun loungers, as well as an umbrella, are available to rent across the Golden Grains, and with ice cream, you are good to go. Don't leave Gozo without booking a tasting at Talmasar Winery. Step inside Our Lady of Ta Pinu Basilica and enjoy the inspiring view. You can also go scuba diving at the Blue Hotel, climb around the Gatija Temple, and if you have enough time, explore the ancient citadel. Don't leave Gojo without tasting traditional meals like pastiz, tara, and aljada. Number 8. Medina City, Malta Check out St. Paul's Cathedral, take in the Cathedral Museum, and stop off at Fontanella Tea Garden. This is a place to enjoy the city's landmark, accompanied by a drink and a bite to eat. Make sure you visit the Knights of Malta experience, and you can also check out the National Museum of Natural History. If you want more adventure, marvel at the Medina Dungeons or wander in the Busket Gardens. Take a stroll along the narrow alleys, view the old Carmelite Church, and you will likely forget what century we currently have. After the exploration, head to Kugis for a cup of coffee. The restaurant has a little rooftop terrace that offers breathtaking views of the island. Number 7. Meliha Meliha Bay is Malta's most attractive and largest sandy beach. The beach has breathtaking views of valleys and picturesque villages. It is an ideal place for visitors to explore. You can also visit Gadira Nature Reserve, the Sanctuary of Our Lady Meliha, Popeye Village, and St. Agatha's Tower. Eat at 180 Kitchen and Lounge. The clue lies in the name, and it offers 180-degree views down to Meliha Bay. Order Mezzi-style sharing plates. The crudo of fish plates include aljada, sea urchins, and giardu oysters. Number 6. Rabat Town, Malta Domus Romana Museum is the most vital place to visit. Inside, visitors are allowed to take a thrilling tour while admiring the mosaics all over the floor. Other places to visit include the catacombs of St. Paul's Church, Wignacourt Museum, and Dingley Cliffs. Try out local delicious meals like aljada, timpani, kinney, and pastizzi during your stay at Rabat Town. Make sure you subscribe to this channel and give this video a like if you are enjoying the content. Number 5. Hall Soflini Hypogom Visitors are astonished by the thrilling world of the prehistoric age at this archaeological site. The Hall Soflini Hypogom existed as an underground graveyard. It has existed since the Neolithic period. The museum allows for the entry of just 80 people per day. It opens at 9 a.m., however, queuing for tickets begins at 8 a.m. Number 4. Tarzian Visitors are allowed to experience the famous and best-preserved prehistoric cult site. Make sure you visit the Tarzian Temple and experience the four massive structures. The alleyways in Tarzian are gorgeous. Make sure you keep your eyes peeled for some hidden niches that are tucked away in the corners of narrow alleys. You can halt here for a snack and take a break from your journey. Number 3. Blue Lagoon Island, Malta The Blue Lagoon is an attractive scene of crystal clear turquoise water, which laps over a white sand beach. Swim in pristine waters and make sure you take your snorkel. Explore the past at the historical tower and battery. Retreat to the hotel or bungalows. And if you want more adventure, go a little wild at Santa Maria Camping. Number 2. Blue Grotto 
experience the views of the coast at the entrance to Blue Grotto. It is a thrilling introduction to the nature reserve. The water is blue each time the sun shines, strikingly contrasted with the limestone bluffs and caves. Visit a nearby restaurant to enjoy Aljada, Brajoli, Kinney, and Fitra. Blue Grotto is a must visit. Number 1. Dingley Cliffs It is one of the most inspiring peaks in Malta. Dingley is the name of a little village in the northern part of the island. Visitors can stroll around, but must be mindful not to walk too close to the edge of the cliff. There are several ways to reach the Dingley Cliffs, by private island tour, car, or bus. Whichever option you choose, be ready to watch the sun light up the white limestone cliffs.